Shakira picked it for me, and honestly, when she first assigned it to me, I was given the Mariah Carey version, and I found out today that I was doing the Jackson 5 version. So I was like, okay, so it's a challenge to be doing a Michael Jackson song, and not only a Michael Jackson song, but a kid, when he was a kid, he was 11, and I'm a grown man. So it was, even though him and Mariah's, it was challenging doing her version too, it was, it, it was extremely challenging doing his, or his take of it. It was it, it wasn't higher, but it was just the well for me the the position in my voice where it is it's at the top of my range and it, it was a lot of falsettos and Shakira wanted me to keep the falsettos in there so you know I had my work cut out for me but she set a really high standard and it was my job as her artist to meet that or attempt to meet that she's honestly changed my life you know I was really self conscious growing up about my my growing up about my voice because it was so unique and people would kind of make fun of me because it was so high. And she told me something off camera. She said, when I was younger, I would go home crying every day after school because people teased me about my voice. And she said, you need to embrace that and share it with the world. It is a beautiful gift from God. And ever since she said that, it just made me kind of like, oh, well, there's nothing wrong with me after all. There's nothing to be self-conscious about. So she's really boosting my confidence a great deal. Um, I, I, my mentality was going into the, the blind auditions was I knew I had to stand out, but it, it kind of backfired on me because they actually thought I was a girl instead of a guy that was doing it. But when they turned around, they were, oh, you know, so going into it, I knew I had to take a chance, something that would definitely set me apart for the crowd. And I, I think it did. Honestly, you know, I just haven't been assigned a song in my lower register yet. But, you know, maybe Shakira may give me one, you know, next week. Who knows? We'll see if I make it through. I honestly would like to do something sexier, something, you know, more for the adult crowd. You know, I, you know, we'll see. Some Marvin Gaye would be nice, something along, maybe some Justin Timberlake, you know, just something that's smooth, that ple you know, to the adult crowd. I would like to do something like that. Hey, everybody, please vote for me, Chris Thomas on Team Shakira. Thank you guys for watching. I love you all.